Back in 2013, a trailer hit YouTube featuring Pinhead in what looked to be a Hellraiser film called Hellraiser Origins. The trailer gained over 80,000 views in the first week it was published. Artist Paul Gerard noticed a decline in the quality of the Hellraiser films as the series progressed and said that a reboot was necessary. He then came up with the concept of Hellraiser Origins, which would serve as a reboot and a prequel at the same time and was said to honor some of the more recent Hellraiser comic books. production of the film took over two and a half years from its pre-production to the premiere, which had most fans thinking that the reboot maybe just wasn't happening. And during the production for Origins, the majority of the publicity for the film was put on Facebook, which is also how Gerard put together a crew for the film, with 47 crew members and 100 extras who all shared Gerard's vision for the reboot. So I guess it was like a fan film or I don't know, something. Concept art was displayed on Gerard's Facebook, but any concept art of Pinhead himself was kept under wraps. And the filming for this took place in a single day in London. After filming was done, a piece for the film was published in Bloody Disgusting Magazine, with concept art included. It was made clear that this was not an official production, and that it probably wouldn't get picked up by Dimension Films. Same as the other films in the series. In regard to Pinhead's design, once it was released, it was received poorly. The reimagining left fans let down, especially since Doug Bradley was not tied to the film and would not be playing Pinhead. With that, the film just never came to be. The trailer still exists on YouTube, but we'll never know what could have been. When asked, Paul Gerard had this to say. I am sad to have to announce that it is very unlikely now that Hellraiser Origins will get made. The world and current film market just wasn't ready for such an elaborate take on the HR universe. We aimed so very high in every single aspect of this feature, but alas, perhaps we aimed too high. Hellraiser Origin would have shocked, elated, thrilled, and amazed its audience. I fully believe that, but alas, the studio and press did not get behind us. So to hell with them. Only the fans got behind us, and I thank you all. The creative hub created from this epic process will never be tamed. We will be back one way or another. With a vengeance. I thank you all for your support and dedication. I have been taken to the heights of elation producing, creating this beast, crushing with disappointment at its failure to find its ground. It's took me a long while to get back to normal, whatever normal is. But expect dark hell to surface from me again. It has to. You can't hold that back. 
Just six days prior to the intended release for Origins, Clive Barker, the director and creator of the original films, announced that he was working on his own Hellraiser reboot, which would feature Doug Bradley as Pinhead. So, there you go. It would have been an interesting concept, but it's just not happening. Although now, they are working on a Hellraiser film coming out in 2022, with Pinhead being gender swapped as a female. So, stay tuned for that. Alright guys, I'll see you later.